Hey, we're gonna make these fun little ceramic succulent bowls or with a cactus inside or something like maybe an aloe plant. So you'll start by making this little bowl and we're also gonna talk about putting a foot on the bottom of it. We'll start off by getting a pinch pot. I'm gonna just pull this part off to make the foot later. And I'm gonna cut my hands and just kind of gently make it into a ball. I've got a little bit of stoneware on there I'm going to pull off. And then I'm going to gently press my thumb into it and start to turn while having the other hand cupped. So I'm basically pushing like this with my thumb. So it's not quite a pinch pot yet. All right, so then once I've really defined that, I can start to make the edges or the walls a little more uniform. And I'm not liking that it's short on this one side here. So I'm gonna kinda go like that. So now we have one that's basically all the same all around and you'll notice it's not like square on the bottom I've really pushed my thumb in there and opened that bottom part out and I've compressed so now I'm gonna give it a tap so that we have a flat top and then I'll give it a little bump here and then I'm gonna roll a little coil out for the bottom. I don't need, I probably don't even need that much. So I'll start by rolling this out. And I'm gonna have my fingers spread apart. I'll move across the coil as I go. And I might need two hands now. So that's about as wide as or as thick as you want it it's for the size of our little vessel here. So then I'm going to turn this pot over. I'm going to take a scoring tool and I'm going to score the whole bottom of it to prepare it for this. And then I'm going to score. I have to be a little bit careful with this because it's kind of a delicate coil. I'll score this one here. And then I'm going to take some slip and I'm going to paint that onto the base. So now I'm going to go ahead and Go around this way and take my needle tool. And I'm gonna cut across like this. Take that little guy out from underneath. And then I've basically got the foot. I'm gonna try to make sure it's level. So I've kind of got my eye down here on the bottom and I can see that it's level. But now I need to bond it in there. To use this tool. You can also use a finger, but my fingers are kind of wet, so I want to go ahead and just join like this. And then I can begin to kind of make sure that this part looks okay on the outside. Smooth things out with my thumb. And I can start to add some texture
that's pretty much the way I want it. It's a little soft, so I might come in later and, and uh, add some more texture when it's a little more closer to leather hard.